I don't want to. Yeah. yeah, between the mics, the fire, and the pins, you're There's just. Fire? <laughs> <laughs> don't spray your hairspray. <laughs> And the chairs hold lot on today, right? And the chairs wire to too, just in case he runs over. We just kind of like that's what <laughs> electrically happens. Get out. You know that's, that's not a bad funny. idea because I always I Do I try not to, to with him because then he's, he's like known for it. as soon I'm as I open out. my mouth he does the one minute left. Oh my god! It up. Nice. Congratulations on this. Thank uh, you. You're you're hearing a lot yeah. of good. Yeah, it's wonderful. Well, it's this is a big effort. I forgot that it you know. That they come out. <laughs> it was enough to do it. To have to deal with it coming out is like ah. It's when you mean thing. enough to do it, was it emotionally draining for you? Oh God, yes. Because it's a, it's, it's not like having a baby. I mean, it's that kind of draining after after it was all said and done. Now, movies like this don't come around at all, hardly at all, for an uh, actress. Especially, I mean, this is a rich part for you. Yeah. Um, did you know that when you first read oh, the yeah. script? It was it can known. change though. You never know. Well, not with Adrian Lyne directing. I mean, no. I knew that the material was married perfectly with its director, you know. And, um, I mean, it seems like it would have been written for him to direct almost, you know. It's his milieu, the whole um, triangle of, you know, those visceral kind of poll-taking questions that he gets audiences to go through. You know, after the movie, people have these big reactions, and they're usually very uncomfortable. But it makes for an exciting time. It's better than just a bunch of visual effects. But that's me, you know. I prefer movies that are more. You mean uncomfortable emotional. about the the subject matter? That so much passion on screen. I mean, there's a lot of passion. You right. really right, right? <laughs> yeah, I had to go for it. But not just that. But I think that there's very few people over the age of 20 that haven't been harmed or caused harm emotionally to other people by deceit, you know. And that's part of growing up, and it's part of being a responsible person emotionally and to see the havoc that's wreaked, you know, I think it's m m very, I don't know. Well, people can relate to ha just out of the blue, obviously your character, both of them, they're sophisticated people. Mm -hmm. They have a great marriage, functional, mm -hmm. nothing dysfunctional. Right. But there's some passion in your character that you really didn't go to before, obviously. Right, well. It just that's the windstorm metaphor at the opening of the movie, I think. Because um, you just never know what's going to blow across your path. And if you're not strong in your knowledge of yourself and what you're capable of and what you, when you know when you have to say no, it's not... Some people, some people can daydream, I think. And, and I'm, I'm not one of those people because that's already starting an affair. I mean, when does it begin? Right. When does it begin? When do, you know? Well, there's also something interesting about the character. Obviously, your your two characters are perfectly matched for mm -hmm. life partners, love, everything. Mm -hmm. You know, it's balance. Your affair with Olivier right. is too intense. To you can't live that way. Oh, it's Look, not sustainable. Well, not only sustainable. Remember what the scene where you get jealous. Now, would you have gotten that jealous if Richard Gere's character, your husband's character, or the husband, right? Was you, there was? I think a it's in direct proportion. <laughs> direct proportion to how naked you feel and how vulnerable you feel with that person. Do you know what I'm saying? I mean, that's, that's the gauge. And how much she had risked to be with him and how offhandedly he received it. Yeah. You know, that, that's hurtful too. You know another thing that I don't know if anyone brought up, but there is no gratuitous sex scenes in this movie. Mm -hmm. Gratu you know what I mean by gratuitous? I know what you mean by gratuitous, yeah. what, what, was it They're all conveying an emotion. Did that help make, because I'm sure it can be uncomfortable to make a movie like this. Yeah. yeah. But is that what was going up through? This is, this is not gratuitous? No, absolutely not. I mean, I, it was all about vulnerability. And that's... That's what the mantra was from Adrian to me. Vulnerable, vulnerable, Connie. You know, make me believe it. <laughs> it well, she, in, yeah, but in the same, we know people like her. She's not vulnerable on the surface, or even really. She doesn't think she's no, vulnerable. No, no. He's jumping out of his chair. I gotta go. <laughs> oh. Isn't that terrible? We had 90 seconds together. No, it was God. great.